How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you today and what a day it is. I did start my own Brawlhalloween event yesterday with the Monster Nash showcase but today the official Brawlhalla Brawlhalloween wow that was a mouthful event has started and that means you guys can finally purchase all the new Brawlhalla Brawlhalloween skins. Let's go ahead and take a look at them. Boom! So, these are the two new ones. We have Dusk Till Dawn and Petra Reanimated. Now, for the purpose of this video, we're gonna be going with Dusk Till Dawn. Really cool looking vampire skin. I'm assuming vampire. I mean, yeah, I don't know. Maybe he's a werewolf, but the cape suggests vampire. I love the uh, spear and I love the orb. We're gonna go ahead and make this purchase, definitely. We're also gonna be doing Petra Reanimated but I'm gonna save that purchase for when I do that video. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the other Halloween stuff we got going on. So we have the jack-o-lantern KO effect, which I got the first year that came out. That was actually a couple years ago, so we already got that equipped. And then they also added a new podium, the Graveyard Shift 2019. And it's pretty cool, I'm gonna go ahead and get it. Um, I'm not gonna lie, it's a little bit similar to like Spellbound Tree, and to be honest, I like the uh, Toil and Trouble better, but for the purpose of this video, we're going to go ahead and use the Graveyard Shift. And then they also have the Rip Avatar and I believe uh, the Pumpkin Pyre Avatar, which I already have that one equipped as well. Not going to use my coins on the Rip Avatar just because I'm saving my coins so I can get black colors with all legends. And black colors, as you know, cost 25,000 gold. So yeah, I want to save my gold. And not last but not least, we have the, uh, the new Haunting Colors. So... These are, I shouldn't say new, because they've been out for a long time, uh, what, well, they've been out in years past for the Bra Halloween event, but these are all the legends that have been released since last year, because I buy them for every legend every time this event rolls around, so, pretty cool, we got Dusk, I'm gonna just go ahead and use Mammoth Coins to unlock these, because like I said, I really want the, uh, coins saved for getting the black colors, it's actually a lot harder for me to get uh, these gold coins than it is to get mammoth coins, so I'm gonna go ahead and use that. Petra, that looks awesome. Can't wait to use her haunting colors. Rayman, sure, why not? Thor, looking pretty good. And then we have Vector. So any legends released after Vector are gonna have to wait until next year's haunting uh, to get the haunting colors. So get those colors while they're here, guys, because it's a long time to wait for the next year. All right, guys, we're going to be dead. Oh, you know what? I also noticed that uh, the Caspian skin right there that you can see the uh, immortal Caspian. He actually looks a lot like the uh, Dusk Till Dawn skin, don't you think? I mean, I might be doing a vampire 2v2 or something. I mean, that's that's definitely a possibility. Let me know if you'd like to see something like that. Oh, and they added Ghost Brawl 2v2. So I'm going to be doing 1v1s with Dusk Till Dawn for sure. But I'm going to do one game of Ghost Brawl just because I want to check it out and whatnot. So let's go ahead and check out the Dusk Till Dawn skin. Oh, wow. Look at that home team colors looking kind of weird. You give them that really like demon red skin there. All right. Lucky Clover. Ooh, that one actually looks really cool. Kind of Kind of makes him look like a goblin. Actually, community colors looking really good on Dusk. I've, I always thought Dusk looked good with community colors. And, uh, yeah, unfortunately, because this is 2v2, we can't see his default color. I forgot about that. But we will. We will. I'm going to do 1v1s. I just want to do one match of Ghost Brawl. See how it is. Speaking of that, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day, wherever you guys might be. I hope you're enjoying the Brawl Halloween festivities. Let me know which Brawl Halloween skin you think is the best. Um, like I said in the last video where I did the Monster Nash, I'm going to be dedicating a video to each of the Bra Halloween skins. So, a whole video for each legend that has a Bra Halloween skin. Oh, okay, alright, I forgot how this one works. So, when you hold still, you're invisible. Alright, he just straight up killed himself. Man, this is actually harder than I thought it'd be. You just gotta... I think in this uh, game mode, particularly, weapon throws are useful. 
because it'll kind of make the person move or get hit by the weapon, you know what I mean? I love the bombs being pumpkins. That is so cute. All right, so there's no team damage either, so that's good to know. I couldn't even see him. I just thought he would be getting caught by that helicopter, man. Oh, dang. I did. I had no idea she got behind me. All right, so Roland is on his final stock, so. Oh, Petra. I mean, Jala. Almost got that double kill there. All right, so Roland should be out of this. Boom! What? Scarlet DC'd before Roland even died. Wow. No fate. So now we're going against a bot. That's no fun. All right, that should be GG. All right, man. I forgot. I even look at my Blackjack Sir Curtis. GG, dude, GG. Thank you for that uh, win bonus right there. Got 300 gold. All right, let's switch to some 1v1s. Online. With Immortal, oh, I'm sorry. Till dusk, dusk till dawn, baby. Now we can use default colors. Dusk. I'm gonna use default colors just for the first match here. And then uh, we'll go from there. I also uh, downloaded some new map skins, so we might be able to see them. This is not one of them. I need to download a map for this uh, map. There's some really, really good looking map mods out there. Oh, going against the Taros. All right, I'm ready. Uh, lately, I've been like kind of losing a lot to Taros. So like he doesn't hit me that often, but he only needs to hit me like three times and I'm dead, you know? So I just got to be very, very, very careful. Look at that. He already got me. To yellow. We were thinking the same thing, weren't we, there, Taros? Holy cow, this guy's actually really good, too. Oh, I thought he'd go for that weapon a little sooner. What? It went through! It went through him! Are you f kidding me? Oh gosh. This is such a close game. Holy moly! We got him, boys! My dusk is not, like, the most warmed up, so... I'm a little bit rusty with the orb and spear, but this is good practice. Oops. Oh, he didn't punish, thank goodness. What? He DC'd? Are you kidding me? The rage quit. He was doing so good, too. So well, I should say. Uh oh. Put the crocky down. Put the. Oh! Died from the bot. The bot killed me. The other dude couldn't kill me, but the bot can. There we go. I'm gonna I'm gonna finish this match because I want the XP. You know what I mean? Dusk is one of the legends that I don't have black colors for yet, so I got gotta get him to level 25. Shouldn't take too long to uh, take out the bot. That might even do it. See, I am so bad, I can't even get the bot dead. Look at the pumpkin bomb. All right, first 1v1, Dusk Till Dawn skin is a rage quit. That's about as good as I could have hoped for. All right, let's try a different color. Oh, I really like community colors and charged OG. Let's do charged OG, man. Goblin Dusk, let's do it. Any uh, Dusk mains out there, because you guys gotta be happy your character got a, ha a Halloween skin, man. There's a lot of characters in this game, and only 10 of them have Halloween skins, so. And being one of the two legends to get new Halloween skins, that's pretty cool. Petra being the other one, of course, we already looked at that. 
And I will be doing that Petra video. I look forward to that. A lot of people think that skin looks kind of ugly. All right, starting off with a strong side sig, eh? I respect that. All right, she likes to play very grounded, so that's good. Okay, okay, woohoo! Oh my goodness, Jala, why are you so strong? He is playing a very passive game, so I need to not play into that. It's kind of interesting. Because, oh, what a, what a combo, dude. Uh, Jala is actually really best played being aggressive. She has so much power. But, nothing against his playstyle. Sniped. Nothing wrong with being passive if that's what you want to do. Personally, I prefer a more balanced approach to the game. Very, very good. Fun edge guarding. Woo! She just dodged down a little bit, or she like spaced downwards a little bit. That's all I needed. Don't do it, don't do it. Oh no. I was tempted to do the neutral sig there, but it probably would have got me killed. I like doing that one on the edge, especially. It's harder to hit mid sage. I've been fighting this whole game. Oh! Over on the left side of the stage. Wow, she took that one from long distance. Oh my goodness, I knew she was doing that. I still jumped into it. That double hit sig, man. Gets me every time. Oops, I meant to do a, uh... Wow, nice combo. Oh, that hurt, dude. That really hurt. Oh, GG. Wow, she had a nice string there. Almost, almost brought me to my grave. GG, Jala, GG. More, see how, see that aggressive gameplay she busted out there at the end? See how that paid off? Should have been doing that the whole game. Should have destroyed me, man. All right, uh, let's, let's go to a different color. Let's do home team. I think it looks really cool. Definitely stands out when you got red skin and black hair. <laughs> kind of like a blood red too. Really cool looking. All right, going against Puro, Tea House, a black Diana. I've had some people in the comments requesting I play Diana and I definitely hear you guys. I will play Diana soon, but I want to get through all the uh, Bra Halloween stuff. I might do a video of a non Bra -Hall Halloween every now and then, just kind of mixed in there, but. Hey. Pura, you got, you got that bow skills down, bro. He plays bow like I do. Calculated as heck. Yeah, he, he also likes those neutral airs, which I do too. 
Ooh. Oh, I left myself wide open. I thought he was gonna chase. He's been waiting for me to make the first move and really paying off. Ooh, the double. How did that not hit, dude? Oh yeah, man. Everybody loves that combo with blasters. Oh, how did I not hit him with anything there, dude? I so was expecting a hit so I could chase dodge. Look, he won't engage me, eh? Hey, come get me. I have no weapon. Okay, now I do. Oh, now he's uh, now he's taunting a little bit. Wanting to get the uh, unarmed KO, you know? I could probably kill him with unarmed, that's fine. Oh. <laughs> I got a long road ahead of me if I want to get a win here though, boys. The first step is believe. I wanted to chase and grab the weapon again, but... Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That move is really good, we all know. That, yep, yep. You could probably beat me just with that. I know because I like doing it too. Oh, GG dude, GG. I think Bo just counters Orb really well. I should have stuck with the spear. GG dude, he absolutely wrecked me though. I did have one suicide, <laughs> my bad. Oh man. All right, let's do one more game, one more game and we're gonna do haunting colors, of course. I gotta do at least one game with haunting, right? Actually, I think the, the ghost brawl I did haunting, so that's cool. You. Oh, going against another Diana. Oh, man, dude. Diana's like my weakness when I'm using Dusk, apparently. Let's see. Oh, this is one of my new maps. If you guys have been watching to the end of the video, you're rewarded with this insanely orange map. And I'm my guy is orange, too, so that makes it even worse. Oh man, he gets me with that down light one more time. I feel like I deserve to lose because Oh man Got him, baby I'm starting to get warmed up to dusk man. I have not played him a lot like I said After I play like five to ten games, I'll start I'll start feeling it. Nice down sig, dude. Man, this map is awesome. I've actually this is the first time I've seen it. Like in my game. Kick you in the face. How? 
Oh, did I not hit him there? That was crazy. Every now and then I like to just do a recovery as I'm falling like that. It really throws people off. He's not doing nearly as many uh, neutral airs as the other guy was doing. And that's probably why he's losing. Oh, what a sig, dude. There you go. Oh, that sig was questionable, but he got the punish anyways. He really committed on that one. Ooh, I just missed his neutral air. All right, I got redemption versus Diana. All right, all right. All right, dudes. Well, thank you for watching this episode of Bra Halloween. I'm going to be doing another Bra Halloween video for the other legends that have Halloween skins. Like, we got Skella Zuri. Uh, we got Bewitching Scarlet. We got tons and tons of other Halloween-themed skins. We got Caspian. We got the uh, Werebat Ragnar. I might be doing videos on all these guys, so if one of your favorite Halloween skins is one of these, we're going to be doing a video on it. As always, guys, be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. This is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, guys.